Today we'll be discussing the cost of overpricing your home. Hi, this is Sean Quinn with Remax Premier. Today we'll be discussing the cost of overpricing your home, but before we do, I'd like to draw your attention to two links. One, if you're looking to buy a home, click on the home search link. And if you're looking to sell a home, click on the free home market evaluation link. Now back to our topic. When you list a home, you have two choices, to either price it right or to overprice it. Pricing the house right obviously assumes that the realtor proved without a shadow of a doubt that they pulled up the proper comparables, that they weighed the features and benefits of the house correctly, and that they're in tune with the market conditions. Naturally, the seller does not agree with the list price, they should openly question the realtor to prove otherwise. Sometimes, not all the time, the sellers want to bump up the price in order to either test the market or uh, to uh, leave room for negotiation. The sellers need to be aware of the costs that can be associated with overpricing a home. Number one, overpricing a home can scare the right buyer away. Sellers tend to think that there's a handful of buyers that want to buy their home at any given time. And the truth is there's usually one or two buyers that want to buy their home and overpricing it can either scare one or both of them away. Two, overpricing a home can cause buyers remorse. Buyers know when they're getting a fair price. If they feel they've overpaid, it's possible they'll be unfair during the home inspection period and it'll cause unnecessary stress complications throughout the deal. Three, overpricing a house can actually net the seller less money uh, for several reasons. A, because the house sits too long on the market, they may have to overcompensate later and underprice the house under market value to get interest in their home. B, the seller's carrying costs need to be taken into account mortgage, taxes, utility costs, all these things can cost them money. Three, things happen, especially in the state of New Jersey, with the weather that we have to homes like, uh, you know, frozen pipes, water in the basement, uh, systems fail like water heaters and furnaces can fail, some pumps. So the sooner that the, the seller sells that home, typically the better, particularly in New Jersey. Last but not least, overpricing a home can cause appraisal issues. When and if there's an appraisal issue, it can really cause stress and ultimately kill a deal. So um, if you'd like a free consultation on the price of your home, we welcome you to contact me. Thank you for watching my video. Thanks and have a great day.